Hi Lifestylers, it's Lushawn. Just found my channel, welcome. And if you are returning to my channel, welcome back. Thank you so much for supporting me here on Lushawn's Lifestyle. I truly do appreciate it. Before we get into this video, go ahead and click that subscribe button if you haven't done so already. And also click the notification bell and um, also like uh, and comment down below um, and share with your friends and family. I think I've got all the preliminaries out of the way. So yeah, there's that. All right, so we're gonna go get right into this. This is my um, Just Do It June hashtag. Just Do It June. And this is, um, sat okay, so this will be for Saturday the 23rd, right? What's it? Yes, the 23rd. And um, this week, as you can see from the thumbnail, I am putting some things in my Poshmark closet. I've had my Poshmark account for um, quite a while and I just used it because I would like to go look and see what I could purchase, you know, not to put anything in the closet. So, um, as I've been, uh, clearing out things and trying to be more minimalist and well just trying to be a little bit more organized um i went through my closet uh my, my clothes my shoes purses all that good stuff so um you know you have to have when you declutter you do those three piles you do the trash pile <laughs> um the donate pile and then the things you can sell and make some money off of so i've already done the trash pile I've already um, given tons of things to um, Goodwill, and then I have some things that I want to try and sell. So um, that's what I'm gonna be doing um, right now. If you hear something in the background, I'm sorry, y'all. It's the, um, I'm off today, and it's the World's Women's World Cup, and today is Sweden in the U.S., and if the U.S. loses, I think this is like win or go home or something like that. So yeah, there's that. So, all right, so this is what the few things that I have that I'm going to put in my Poshmark closet. I will leave my um, Poshmark closet um, username and all that good stuff down below. And I also, you'll see it all. I'll put a picture of what it looks like on the screen as well so you'll know that it's me. Um, but basically, um, I have three purses. Um, I have two coach bags and a Dooney and Burke bag. And then I have, one, two, three, four. And then I have, um, well, yeah, well, four pair of shoes and a pair of boots. So real quickly, um, the first one I'm gonna list is, this is a cross body bag. Um, I think I only use this twice, if that, but you can see it's um, in great condition, no wear and tear. Like I said, I barely, I think I did it once, once or twice twice at the most I used it so you can see it's really it's like almost like brand new so so I'm gonna put this out there um, I have a Dooney and Burke that I barely use this small these make great gift ideas for like um, if you have like a teenager or you know like a really young adult that um, you you know want to do something special for or give a gift to these will work so this is the, the Dooney and Burke that I have. You can see barely worn. There's no wear and tear on the bottom. It's almost like virtually brand new. Inside is like new. Um, authentic, authentication and sticker and all that stuff is in there. So I'll do really good pictures when I post it um, to my Poshmark closet. But yeah, it's not even the, the handles aren't even worn because I barely I think I used it maybe once or twice, if that. And then I have another coach bag, um, again. Now this one has a little spot on the back. I don't know how that happened. I mean, it's barely noticeable. It's like the color of the beige almost, but I pick up on all that kind of stuff. <laughs> so, but yeah, you can see the handles aren't worn. Or the cloth and is not dirty or anything. It's really fairly new, you can see inside. Um, like yeah i barely barely um use this at all i think maybe three or four times at that but you can see almost like new really clean so yeah so i'm gonna put this out there as well 
Um, as far as shoesies, all of the shoes are new, never worn. And um, this, the first two are from Shoe Dazzle. I'm sure y'all are familiar with Shoe Dazzle back in the day, the shoe subscription um, company. So everything is still in here. You can see one of them is still in the bag. I need to take it out. But this is the shoe here. It's really cute that um, I'm going to put out there. And um, these are a size, I think a size eight. Yes. Yeah, these are size, size eight. So I'm going to put this out there. Um, or in my closet. Um, another shoe dazzle that I'm gonna put out there. You see still, like, I don't even know if I open this when I got them or whatever, but see, they're a bag, this one's still wrapped. But this is the shoe, never worn. These are really cute, I love that. So yeah, that's the shoe that I'm gonna put out there. The shoes that I'm gonna put out, it still has the, Oh, it still has the bag. So I'm gonna do those. Next I'm going to and I'm sorry I'm being distracted by this soccer game. Um these are Liliana's. I got these off of oh I can't remember the website I got them from. But these are size eight. Um these are really cute. But it's these. Um, so these are elastic, so you get a little, get a little give with that, but, um, these are, um, it, and that one's still wrapped. <laughs> so you can see, guys, they are new, still new, and this is size 8. And then I have another one. I just probably got it in a different color. Okay, comment down below. Am I the only one when I bear, buy shoes? If I like it a certain style, I'll at least get a nude and a black. Is it just, or is it just me? All right, so here's the color. Here's that shoe in nude. And this, I think I wore these once. I did wear these one time because I was looking for a new, new shoe. So yeah, these I did wear. I did wear these once. I did not wear the black ones, but I did wear them. One, one time, I, 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 I remember one time I wore those. So I'm gonna put those out there. And again, that size eight. And then I have um, some boots. These are thigh highs. <laughs> um, and these are by Just Fab. Again, another one of those shoe subscription. Can you see that, Just Fab? Shoe um, subscription companies. I don't have those anymore. I don't have those subscriptions anymore. I, stop doing that because sometimes I would forget and then they send me shoes and I have to send them back and it was just ain't nobody got time for that so these are new never worn these are thought red thigh highs <laughs> I know child thought thoughty thoughtyville right thought thought thoughty Thoughtiana alright so yeah but these are really cute um they'll go good in the winter these are um suede you know with the zipper so these would go good with, like with some jeans it has the hidden platform so you're not standing like this you still are level you just can't see it because it's hidden but yeah these would go cute with some like black jeans white top with a you know black leather jacket or something like closer to the fall you know yeah these would go great so yeah never wore these brand new they are still packaged in the box and all that good stuff so i'm just gonna start off with just a few things um in my own put in my posh mark um closet and let me tell you disclaimer right off the bat i am not becoming a reseller on poshmark that is not the goal here the goal is is to periodically I have a huge pile of things that I don't use that I'm trying to sell. So I'm going to just periodically put things in my closet and to see how it does and try to sell it. But I'm not like going out and purchasing things, things to sell on Poshmark. Um, uh, 
I don't know if you all follow her here on, um, or if you're subscribed to her here on YouTube, but Tara Gay Nicole, you guys know we're cool and everything that's my sis. And she, ha she does Poshmark, and so I hear what she goes through. She tells me some of the things that, you know, she deals with, you know, having to keep up with your Poshmark. So yeah, I'm not trying to do all of that. <laughs> so I'm just trying to sell some things that, you know, that I had purposely put aside and said I was gonna sell after I had cleared out what was trash, um, what uh, a lot of the stuff that I donated um, and gave away. And then these are the things that I'm selling. So periodically I will just put things in my Poshmark closet to sell, but I am not trying to become a um a reseller in Poshmark I'm telling y'all right now so yeah so I will have everything linked below so that you all if you want to take a gander again like I said some of these things can make great gift ideas if you want to um purchase something for someone or you know like these little purses for teenagers um I do have um majority of my bags I think are coach I'm doing in Burke if I'm not mistaken um that I'm trying to sell because I um, I bought a really, really nice, this is neither here nor there, but I had bought a really nice um, Michael Kors black that I'm like, I'm just trying to stick with one, one or two purses and keep it at that. So, anywho, that is my um, hashtag just do it June to um, get these things up in, or into my Poshmark closet so I can get them out of that sold and out of the house and and be done with it so yeah um so if you've lasted this long of the video you already know you are a lifestyler and until my vi next video <laughs> um hugs and love and remember check your subscription make sure i know a lot of people are viewing me but if you subscribe or you think you've subscribed and it may not be that way apparently youtube has done a whole bunch of changes with their algorithm and they've really screwed up a lot of stuff so um just double check if you haven't subscribed and and or if you subscribe and then it like unsubscribes you for whatever reason so anywho husband love and i'll see you in my next video bye